and Nigel here from Sax School. I got an 80s classic for you today. I want to show you how to play the uh, the sax parts in Glenn Fry's You Belong to the City. So a Miami Vice classic uh, and a real 80s um, classic bit of 80s saxophone pop playing. Uh, it's a great little tune. I only used a few notes so um, let's crack on straight away at the start of this with uh, the very first phrase. But actually before we do that on the, in the original key, on the alto saxophone, this is in the key of E major. So that means for us, we've got F sharps, we've got uh, G sharps, we've got C sharps, and we've also got D sharps, okay? So with your little finger down here. Um, so F sharp, C sharp, G sharps, and D sharps, four sharps, all the way through. Um, okay, so the first little bit sounds like this. <laughs> So this is at the intro, the very start of the track. Those notes, E, D sharp, B, and then E, D sharp, B, C sharp. Can try it with me. Here we go, one, two, three. <laughs> nice and steady at the start isn't it then again it goes e d sharp b the same as the first time and then it does this tricky thing now essentially we're going from g sharp to b back down to g sharp but in between we're doing some little extra notes okay so we're going g sharp a a sharp or B flat to B. I'm playing it on the front because for me that feels quite slick, but you might choose to go on the side. G sharp, A, B flat, B, and then back down again. B, B flat, A, G sharp, um, B, B flat, A, G sharp. So, do ya ya da. On the side. On the front. Now it might take a little bit of practice that just to get it sounding really smooth. But really what we're trying to get is kind of like a smooth flow, like a bend up and a bend back down again. Okay, so let's go from the beginning to that point. Here we go. One, two, three. Okay, so if they're on, it goes a bit the same. E, D sharp, but it goes to C sharp this time. And then it does it again, E, D sharp, C sharp. So let's try that. And there's a tricky little bit here where it goes G sharp, A, B, B, and then another really long B. So those last three notes, G sharp, A, B, and then a really long B. So let's play that intro section now all together. Nice and slow, it starts on a high E, remember? Uh, one, two, three. And then the band kicks in. Okay, 
There's three bars of the band, and then he basically does the same thing again, but in tempo with the band. So it starts off E, D sharp, B. Then he goes E, D sharp, B, C sharp. And he does that all over again. E, D sharp, B. E, D sharp, B, C sharp. And that's it, that's the intro. So we try that bit then. So this is from after the band kicks in, which is after A on our music. Ready? One, two. <laughs> Okay, so that's it. That's the intro part. Now, the other main part that I want to show you, because he does some filling in bits all the way through the sax player as well, but the main solo part what I want to show you. It's the same note, but it's just up an octave. So he does a really cool growl up to high E. So we're using one, two, the octave key at the back. Um, and we're also using the top key here. So one, two, octave key, and this. Now he does a scoop up to it and a bit of a growl as well. And you gotta get, kind of get that Miami Vice 80s thing happening. Put your leather pants on, that might help. So those notes are the same, right? High E and then D sharp, which high D is just, high D sharp is just those two with the octave key, okay? So high E, high D sharp, B. High E, high D sharp, B, C sharp. And then he does this cool thing. Which is G sharp, F sharp E, F sharp E, C sharp, C sharp. G sharp, F sharp E, F sharp E, C sharp. Ba 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 do ba da ba. Ba 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 do ba da ba. Okay, and then he finishes by going B, C sharp, E, C sharp. Make those B and the C sharp nice and short. Da da da. And the last bit is G sharp, low E, F sharp E, C sharp, C sharp. And low C sharp, remember, it's got your little finger down here and your C sharp finger over here, okay? <laughs> So should we try the whole sax solo section? That's at the bottom of our page of music. And remember it starts with a big scoop, a growly scoop up to high E. One, two here, octave key and the top key here. Here we go. One, two. Those are all the main notes for this uh, for this solo, for the um, you know you belong to city. And it, it, the only other thing that happens in this I mentioned is that there's some extra little filly bits he does around, but he uses all the same kind of notes. Uh, so you just got to experiment, have a listen to what he's playing, and think about the notes you've already learned in the melodies because he uses those same notes but just mixes them up a little bit for the fills. So have some fun with that. Get your 80s on and uh, see if you can get that real 80s sound that they're getting on that recording because um, it's a cool sound. You need to have lots of air, not nice firm embouchure, and uh, and get have a go at getting that growl sound going as well where you're using a scoop, you're singing through the saxophone and uh, roughing it up a bit. Have some fun with that. Practice hard. I'll see you on the next lesson.